Step five in my OneNote productivity system is execute. Executing on those to-do lists that gets created by all the stuff you collect in the collection section. And by working on the most important task at that point in time, helps you know that you can focus completely on that task. And while I'm getting stuff done, I like to listen to music and create my own productivity bubble. So I use a headset for that. And I have some criteria for headsets, like noise cancelling, so I can be in a noise environment, also noise cancelling on the microphone. I like it to be certified for Skype for Business and Teams, so I don't have to switch headset when moving from productivity to a Skype and Teams call. And it also needs to be good for music, and it needs to support jack cable. So I can replace my long haul flight as well and the headset I use there for in-flight entertainment with my productivity headset. And there is such a headset that support all those criteria, and that's the Sennheiser MB660. It has noise cancelling, great audio quality both for music and movies. It has uh, the ability to be certified for Skype for Business through this Bluetooth dongle. And it's really important that you use this Bluetooth dongle if you're using it for Skype for Business and Teams, because that's where the Skype for Business and Teams drivers are. That's where it supports comfort noise, wideband audio, which is part of Skype for Business and Microsoft Teams, and it becomes the default device so that the button works when you're using this as a Skype device. I also found that there is no delay when using this Bluetooth dongle and watching movies on my computer. Typically with Bluetooth, there is a delay. Could be a long delay and a short delay, but you may see that it doesn't sync with lip sync. So, which means that this device works for all my scenarios and can be my single device. And it has wired through USB, so it can charge at the same time as you use it, or wired through jack. There are some alternatives, because the Sennheiser headset is a bit pricey. And the first alternative is the Plantronics 8200 UC. It has all the same capabilities as the Sennheiser headset, but it has delay when using it for Bluetooth audio when watching movies. It's a slight delay, but you will as you notice it, it will become unbearable to watch, at least for me. And I also noticed it can distort the audio if there's too much buzz in the scene or in the music, the audio gets distorted because there is a, quite a round buzz in this headset, which uh, will distort the audio on, on higher volumes. But other than that, it's a great noise cancella cancellation headset and it will help you focus and it will replace that both headset on long haul flights. The third option is the much cheaper Plantronics Voyager Focus UC headset. It's been around for quite some time. It's great for Skype and Teams calls. It's great for noise cancelling and it works in noise environments as it has a great microphone phone boom as well. But it doesn't have the ability to do wired audio through jack cable. So you don't won't replace your long haul flight headset, but it will replace your professional headset from productivity point of view and a Skype for Business and Teams point of view. It also has a Bluetooth dongle, so use it, but it also has quite some delay on audio when watching movies. It's not the problem for Skype calls, but it is a problem for entertainment. So that's my recommendation around productivity headsets that are certified for Skype for Business, wireless, noise cancelling, and replaces that Bose headset for long haul flights. Because the MD660 is equally or better at noise cancelling and audio quality. That being said, the equalizer that follows the headset as default settings are not quite as good as what you can set yourself. So you should install the app for the Sennheiser headset and you should create your own equalizer setting called Director. And you should tune it like I show you here because you will use the movie setting 
with the full bass and, and uh, treble and so on, but remove the echo section. So it works well for music, works well for Skype calls and Teams calls, and works well for movies. So now you know what kind of headset you should choose. Choose one of these headsets, but I prefer the Sennheiser headset if you have uh, the extra money to buy it.